Update. Lava Geyser reaches height of about 1,100 feet before episode 27 of Kilauea's summit eruption ends. Update at 10.09 p.m. Sunday, June 29, 2025. Episode 27 of the ongoing episodic summit eruption of Kilauea Volcano on the Big Island within Halema Umo. Crater ended abruptly shortly before 8 p.m. Sunday, June 29, after nearly 11 hours of continuous, sustained, and powerful lava flow. The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory reported at 8.20 p.m. in its volcanic activity notification that the fading lava flow from the north vent in the southwest part of the crater stopped completely at 7.54 p.m., several hours after reaching a maximum height of about 1,116 feet. Flames were still visible at the south vent for several minutes afterward. The high fountain produced about 1.6 billion gallons of lava, covering 80% of the crater floor. Since the end of the water fountain, volcanic gas emissions have decreased dramatically. Lava flows from this episode in the southern part of Kalua Pele, Kilauea's summit caldera, may continue to exhibit slow movement or incandescence as they cool and solidify over the next few days. The Uekahuna tilt meter recorded approximately 16.4 micro radians of deflation during this episode, which also coincided with a rapid change from deflation to inflation at the summit and a decrease in the intensity of seismic tremors. Most ongoing episodic summit eruption episodes have lasted about a day or less and have been separated by lulls in activity that generally last at least a few days. The sights and sounds of the Kilauea Summit Eruption. Captured up close by geologists with the USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory. The scientists were under a sky to fall in Tefra on Wednesday as the 